Oh my gosh! Lord! What's happening? <laughs> Yo! What's good? My fellow main characters, my name is Bam, and welcome back to the channel for another video. And I thank God! That both me and you are allowed to watch some more anime. And today, my fellow main characters, we are back at it again with that good old Zom 100. Bucket list of the dead. The title of this episode actually is Flight Attendant of the Dead. So are we going in the plane or something? Who knows? Let's figure it out. <laughs> Yo, what type of video game we playing? Yo, I can't take Akira seriously, bro. Is this guy still naked? You're in a whole zombie apocalypse. And for funsies, you want to play a video game where you kill zombies, Left 4 Dead 2? <laughs> Ooh, that looked good! Hold on! <laughs> in this world, a zombie apocalypse? Today? We don't got many- Hold on, I need to see that again. Hold on. First of all, why is she throwing it back like that? Yeah! Yeah, I love their relationship already, man. Akira is just earnest and just wants to go for what he wants. And this guy is like earnest, but in a like, the odds don't look like it's in your favor, but don't worry, buddy. <laughs> That's my list. Yeah, forgot your own list, buddy. Mm. But then we sometimes we put our dreams on hold for like work and life stuff. Oh, watch where you're going. Oh, there's a firefighter still alive. What the heck? Oh, no, that's a zombie. <laughs> it's a zombie and his, his hose is releasing fire. Is literally a firefighter. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh my gosh! Oh, yeah, that'd be game over. We need to get out of here right now. Let's see what we're about to do, boy. Yeah, goggles on! We don't got time! Let's go! <laughs> let's go, Kira! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Why is this? So oh my gosh! Woo! Oh! Woo! Get up! Get up! Meow. Close it! Close it! Oh my gosh! Oh snap! Survivors. Wait a minute! Y'all were surviving in here with the whole uh the whole thingy still open. Y'all are lucky to be alive, bro. Moving like this, y'all crazy. You'll be aight. You'll be aight. Yo, honestly, for any place to be locked down in the zombie apocalypse, this is Loki the best place to be. You got all this groceries, this water, this food. You're set for like weeks, my guy. Maybe even months. That's what I'm saying. They're stocked up. <laughs> it's a chance. Kind of feels like. <laughs> oh shit! That's true. They are winding and dining right now. Yo, zombies outside though. We gotta handle that. Damn, you drank the whole bottle, bro. Damn. Yo, look at this man. He's so smooth with it, bro. He's so smooth with it! Okay. Mmm. Ha ha! Oh my gosh, this guy. Why does he always take off his clothes? Yep, that's what happens when you just down a whole bottle of tequila, bro. Okay. Oh, don't tell me you're bitching, dude! Oh, it always do be this random dude that's always quiet, not talking to nobody, bro. This is one of my biggest pet peeves. If you get bit, ta 
hell to me? We could have cut off your leg or something. We could have tried stuff, bro. At least let us like lock you up. Yo, why you gotta keep that on the down low? For what? You're gonna turn to a zombie and die and kill us all? For what? Please? This is not the place, dude. You just vomited in the toilet. <laughs> uh, I mean, you had a boyfriend. Until you see him in person, you had a boyfriend. <laughs> oh, put some clothes on, dudes! Oh, she's done. Oh, and she's still drinking? I want to live. That's my dream right now. My dream is to live. Oh no! Are you serious? No! No! Oh, she's bit. Oh no. Yeah, don't hug her, bro. She's done. Oh my gosh. It's all due to that trash character, bro. Oh my gosh, man. Bro, tell us when you're bit, bro. Tell us when you're bit. And this guy just crawling. Wow. I love this show, man. Found a TV. Wow. Yeah, sad, bro. <sighs> Remember my childhood dream. It's weird because I watched this episode and I'm just like, huh, does Akira and Kendo like care people that like just die? I'm not sure if Kendo does, you know, Kendo is out here smooth talk and play, got <laughs> he got a little bit of happiness in the middle of the apocalypse if you know what I'm saying. For Akira though, like really felt for her man, like and it's, it sucks man, like it sucks like you just meet these people at this time and then boom like that because of some stupid because of some dumb dude man some dumb dude that didn't want to tell everybody he was bit bro you know you're gonna turn into a zombie bro you know you're gonna turn into a zombie man and you're just gonna leave us all hanging like this bro it was sad but i think the whole idea of like why akira kind of like smiles at the end and kind of you know overcomes that and kendo's kind of like um i'm pretty sure kendo probably cared about them but not to like a high crazy degree but like he it's kind of like being super it's like both characters akira and kendo are kind of like being very present focused they're being like what's 
presented to me right now. There's so much reasons in this world to be sad and upset about, especially in this world they're living in right now. <sighs> She's gone, you know? These people are gone. I cried for them in the moment, but they're gone. Like right now is the present, right now I'm living my life, so <sighs> I'm gonna put a smile on and I'm gonna live. That doesn't mean you can't grieve or process that, of course, but it's like, yo. So yeah, my film and characters, that is my thoughts and feelings about Psalm 100, episode four. Loved it, man. Um, it was a tough episode. There was, there was some elements where I'm like, dang, man. So anyways, my film and characters, thank you for watching this video. Like the video if it made you smile, comment this video made you think, and subscribe when you see more. And always remember that yes, you are the main character of your own story. My name is Bam, and I'm out.